Welcome to phase two of Solution and Innovation Skills. In your second assignment, we explore how to create and discover towards an innovation. We offer you two real-life and existing companies. One is AeroVironment and one is Graphoid. Both companies are at the leading edge of innovation, introducing solutions and technologies that are changing our lives. In the library, you will find more information and video links on these two companies. We ask you as a team to choose one of these two companies and imagine that you would be a business that is a client of either AeroVironment or Graphoid. Think in your team of 10 different innovative product applications which you as a client of either of these two companies could be developing and offering. We then ask you to evaluate your 10 innovations along the two dimensions which we worked with in the first phase. First, to what degree does your innovative product application solve an important problem which your prospective customers have? And second, on the other dimension, how high is the risk that a social factor will prevent your innovation from succeeding? Discuss in your team and then submit in the lab on the platform. For this assignment, we have three experts and their insights to support you. Ron Meyer explains about successful exploration and creativity. Rolf Pfeiffer shares his experiences on collaboration and leadership. And then I will think through with you the importance of problem identification. Make use of each of these three concepts during your assignment by applying them to the way you work in your team. And do not forget, make ample use of the forum to ask questions, discuss your thoughts and share your ideas with our learning community. As an additional, optional exercise, we also recommend you to watch the movie Apollo 13. Identify sequences in that movie which correspond to the three topics of the second assignment. Reflect the importance of these elements during the Apollo 13 mission and its problem-solution process for bringing the astronauts safely home. For those of you who have decided to participate in the Cathedral Building Game competition, there are further instructions now in the library. We are looking forward to your discussions in the forum and please enjoy.